This is Twit. So the reason he mentioned this image recognition improvement is to announce a new project called Google Lens, which I think is very exciting and yes. very interesting. It's initially going to come with Google Assistant, which, by the way, is now going to be in the iPhone, as well as you know more places than ever before. It's and funny, it's also you can hear the, the cheers in the room were from like the, the front most biggest Google executives. They They're all the iPhone phones. users, yes. Yeah. <laughs> so so uh, I love the, this. Yes. Yeah. I have been come wanting on. this forever since we had smartphones that were smart enough because I like constantly do things like walk through my yard and I'm like, ooh, is this a weed or is it a plant? Can oh, I eat it also? Go. Can I eat this? That's this something is that a human <laughs> would be not Can as I good at, right? If you showed exactly. uh, that weed to me, I'd say, yeah, eat it. Well, let's see what happens. But Google would know, Google Lens would know if you could eat it. Exactly. And it say, so I'm excited. That. Don't listen to Leo. He's trying to kill you. I that like the image he idea. showed. He showed a, a, a flower. This, I would do. I do this all the time too, Stacy. He showed a flower. I say this all the time. I'm looking out. The, we're we're taking a walk. I'm looking out the window. What is that? And he showed a flower, and it, it actually figured out what the flower was. And then assistant offered you more things you could do with that, including buy it, which I thought was really interesting. That's going to be very very valuable. Is you, this you, same as? Google goggles. Is I was just going to say, you remember the old product. Yeah. Product. I'm, I'm looking at an article from 2011. Google goggles gets faster, smarter, solves Sudoku. It can scan barcodes, oh, but barcodes. it can also take a picture of a bridal dress and be able to go to everything I mean, gets it's, advanced a bit at a time. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, Google goggles was an app later. that you could install and use and do a lot of this, at least some of this stuff. Albeit now, I mean, with the power of, you know, the technology nowadays and AI working on, on the back this end, is, this, it's like this on steroids. Same. I think yeah. they had to program the data from Google goggles. What is different here, it, this, is my, this is what I vaguely remember from Google goggles. It had to be already entered in some sort of image database. So, like, it had to be a famous monument and things like that. What's cool here is... The image recognition is doing the work. This isn't like a predetermined database. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. Yes, absolutely. That's exactly the difference. I think you nailed it.